Good afternoon, the Alluvial Adventure team. We are back in the Alluvial Adventure kitchen. Gonna make another post-workout meal. Today we're going to have deep sea scallops. We're going to have some corn, boiled in Caribbean jerk seasoning. So the corn will be just a little bit spicy. Maybe you want to call it Caribbean jerk corn, either way. Also gonna have some more citrus salad, which is gonna consist literally of three oranges, a Bartlett pear, and some honey. And the leftovers from the shrimp boil yesterday, we've got some leftover potatoes and sausage that we're gonna warm up and have as a side dish also. So scallops, corn, leftover potatoes and sausage, and citrus salad. We're going to grill the scallops, but the weather is not conducive to that this afternoon out there. So we're going to cook them in the house, probably saute them in a little bacon fat, which will be delicious. Not maybe not as good for you as they would have been grilled, but you know, it is what it is. So we're going to have them fried in bacon fat. So you guys stay with us. And we'll try to make this enjoyable and fun. All right, guys, we're going to trim up our orange slices just a little bit, get some of the, we've got all the pith off of it, and we're going to cut some of the tough part of the skin off of it and slice it. We've also got our scallops there blotting on a paper towel. Probably don't have to tell everybody that it's not cool to put liquids in hot grease. So we want the scallops as dry as possible to keep from having any blowback. Y'all have to ignore the my dog. I know y'all can hear him growling in the background. He's uh he's got a gnat stuck to his eyelid. Now he thinks that gnat is a grizzly bear. But in reality, it's just a gnat stuck to his eyelid. I wish you guys could smell that bacon frying back there. We're going to garnish the top of our citrus salad with a fresh Bartlett pear we stumbled across while we were foraging at Kroger. And once again, we're going to top this off with a little honey. Local honey is always better. All the pollen helps your body build up antibodies to allergies. So every chance you get, use local honey and all your cooking, sweeten your tea or coffee with it. We do every chance we get. All right, guys, we're kind of at an impasse right now. Uh, we'll be back with y'all in a few minutes. Well, guys, we're back. 
We've got the salad made, it's sitting. Uh, we're going to season the scallops and start cooking them. I think the bacon's rendered down enough that the scallops will saute in the hot fat or grease. Just gonna use a very basic, basic seasoning. We're going just a, a hint of Old Bay. And there are other seasonings. Everglades seasoning is great. Tony Shasheries, it's the Sherry's, however they say it down there. It's also very good. And whatever your favorite seasoning might be. In this case, we're gonna use a hint of Old Bay just a little black pepper, some good old garlic salt. And then we're going to come over here, and place some of those in the hot bacon fat and get, get that part. There's that sizzle. Scallops are like shrimp, they're very they're lean, they're tender, they don't doesn't take them very long either. We'll make sure they don't stick. He's still fighting that grizzly bear, y'all don't pay him no attention. Guys, we're gonna let these cook a little bit and we'll be back with y'all here in a few minutes. The second batch is going to have a whole lot more flavor because it'll have the benefits from being cooked than the griffins and rendering from the first batch. Both will be good, but these will have a much more distinct flavor.
if a person wanted to, when the job's done, you could take some type of cream or some type of white wine and pour in there and loosen the drippings from the pan and make, I'm sure, a wonderful sauce to go with this. We're not going to do that tonight because we're good with what we got. But next time, we'll make a sauce out of what's left in the pan. We'll see how that goes. Alright guys, we're going to finish everything, get ready to plate the food. We'll be back with y'all in a minute. Okay guys, we've got our supper plated. We've got the Caribbean jerk corn. We've got the citrus salad with a little bit of local honey. We've got some leftover potatoes from the shrimp boil from yesterday. And then we've got the seared scallops. So let's try one. Hang on. Before we get off on the wrong foot, let's put a little of this butter that we took the time to melt on that corn because butter is always good on corn just like it is potatoes. Probably wouldn't be bad on the scallops either. Okay, now we're ready. Perfect. Mm. Good afternoon, Louisville Adventure team. Thank y'all for joining us in the, for another evening in the kitchen. Had some pan seared scallops, seared and bacon fat, a little citrus salad. Caribbean jerk corn on the cob. We just boiled that corn in Caribbean jerk season out of this world. It was great. Uh, thank you for joining us again. We appreciate you guys. Thank you to all the subscribers. It means so much to the channel. It means a lot to me. Appreciate you guys and join us for the next one.